Well, we're gonna go shopping. Let's get on up the road. Hey, hey friends, and welcome back to this week's grocery haul. We are going to do a shop with me today. That's right, I'm going in the store. I know, crazy, isn't it? <laughs> but it's gorgeous outside, and why not? So, I'm gonna take you along with me today, show you what we got, show you some new things throughout Walmart, and then we'll come home, get it all unloaded, and we'll go through the grocery haul and the meal plan. Let's get going, y'all. Come on, let's go. Those are really, really cute. They're little LED lights. See them? Those are $5.98. Now these little glasses are really cute, but they're only $1.98. So they're plastic, but they're very cute. And then I love this, this wooden rose wreath. It is a $19.98, but it's so cute. But they have all kinds of stuff. What is this? This burlap wreath, patriotic, so pretty. We can just mention this section. It's all clearance tags, which are my favorite. <laughs> Take a peek at it. That is cute. You know, like I don't have enough cups, but I really like that one. I don't know why, but I do. And I'm pretty sure it would fit under my Keurig as well, so that's nice. Maybe I'll get it. All the new Pioneer Woman stuff. They don't really have much different than what I already have, so nothing really new on this side of things right here so we'll just mosey on down this way <laughs> oh, i like those bowls those are kind of cool looking these are what i was looking for because one of my bowls like this cracked so Here's the information on them. They're just the um, mainstay serving bowl set. They have like the blue. This is the color that I already have. And then they've got the pinky speckle color as well. So I am gonna pick up another set of these. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and get the blue this time. Cause I like the blue. So I'll go ahead and get these. So starting back here, we've got two gallons of 2% milk. I've got another thing of the blueberry cobbler creamer. And then I picked up some buttermilk as well. And then I picked up a pound of yellow American cheese and then a pound of just the sliced ham. I got two pounds of the 90-10 ground beef. Caught those on sale for those are about like $4.99 a pack. So it was pretty good for the 90-10. And then I got some bun size beef ranks um, just to have on hand put back on in the freezer because they were also on sale. Then I picked up a block of Colby Jack and a block of extra sharp cheddar. Two things of white slice bread, um, some brioche buns because we're going to be making some fancy, fancy chicken sandwiches. They're not really fancy, but I just thought I'd throw that in there. And then I got some top sliced hot dog buns for meatball subs as well. And then some everything bagels for a quick breakfast or lunch or anything like that. Back here, I got some whipped topping. I stopped by Food Line and that's where I got this stuff right here. So got some whipped topping. I'm gonna be making a cake soon that needs that. 
got some palmetto cheese, just the pimento cheese. Y'all, this stuff is so good. They also have a um, jalapeno kind, but they were out of it, so I could only get the palmetto, but that's okay because this stuff is amazing. If you have not tried it, definitely give it a try. Then I picked up some chip dip. Y'all know this is my favorite. It is the hell of a good dip. So I got some of it. And then some chive and onion cream cheese for these bagels right here. Awesome combination. <laughs> so if y'all haven't tried those two things together, you might want to give it a try if you like that sort of thing. And then back here, I got some matcha meal, our favorite cereal, the Fruity Dino Bites. And then I got some shredded wheat as well. And then eggs, two things of eggs. Forgot those, plum, forgot them. So two dozen of eggs. Actually, they've come down. They're about like $1.86 now. So I was excited about that. So I picked up two more cartons of those. This also come from Food Line. They have these on sale for I think $3.99 a bag. Y'all, this makes the best lazy lasagna ever. So good. <laughs> so um, that'll probably be on the menu this week as well. And then produce wise, I got one of my favorite pineapples ever, the Honey Glows. Y'all, they are so good, so, so good. <laughs> so I picked up one of them. I got some squash, cause I'll probably be making either some sauteed squash, roasted squash, or some squash casserole, it just depends. And then I picked up a bunch of bananas as well. I got some Roma tomatoes. These are turning out to be kind of my favorite maters right now until I get my ones out of my garden. And then y'all know, I love me some maters. But these will do until I get those. And then I picked up these little potato companies. It's got the red, white, and the purple taters in there. And these are so good um, because they're so tiny. They cook quick. So it's perfect for a quick weeknight meal. And they're really good. I love those purple taters. So I got some of those. And then on back here, I got a thing of the kosher petite pickles. Um, they're my favorite. I love those little tiny pickles. And then of course I had to get another thing of Duke's mayonnaise for the prepper pantry. I also picked up some grape jelly, uh, like some apple jelly as well. Didn't have any in my prepper pantry. So that's why I got one of each. Also to stock up on, I got some beef broth, chicken broth, and corned beef hash. So I got two each of those to put back. I needed some more vegetable spray, so I got a jar of that as well. And also to put back up, I got some mild salsa. Love to keep that on hand, and that is the best salsa ever. So I got some of that. Picked up another box of cocoa wheats to also put back in the pantry. Some Cheddar Bay biscuit mix, because that's what we'll be having with our lazy lasagna. <clears throat> also picked up another thing of the Supreme Walnut brownie mix. These are my absolute favorite. So I wanted to go ahead and get another box of those. Picked up a four pound bag of sugar because I needed to put one back. I just used one. So I always like to replace it in the prepper pantry. And then I got another 12 count of the blonde roast coffee. This is my favorite coffee. Over here, I picked up some strawberry jello and some berry blue jello because we're going to be making a cake with that cool whip right there. So that's going to be, like I said, in an upcoming video. And then I needed to stock back up on some bacon pieces. I love keeping this in my pantry as well. And then I also picked up four of the Italian seasoning, just the dry Italian seasoning mix. I like to keep those on hand and I was completely out. So I picked up four of those. And then y'all, can we just appreciate this? <laughs> <laughs> these, oh, I love Reese Pieces. They are so good. So when I saw these in cookies form, uh, of course I got them. This is why I need to stay out of the store and doing my own shopping because if I do it online and do my pickup order, I don't see stuff like this. <laughs> so I can keep from buying it. But anywho, nonetheless, I bought them and we're gonna eat them. And then I also picked up some Better Than Bouillon, um, just the chicken bouillon. I got some more Padilla Complete seasoning. 
And then I also picked up some remoulade sauce. That's gonna be for these chicken sandwiches I'm making. Y'all, y'all ain't gonna wanna miss it. Trust me on that one. And then I didn't have any more sun-dried tomatoes, so I picked up another jar to put back as well as some dill relish. So all this is gonna be put back in the prepper pantry. I got a huge five pound bag of white rice. I was completely out. So now we have enough of that. I got some s'more jet puff marshmallows. Every once in a while, I love eating marshmallows. Also, if you have a sore throat or strep throat, anything like that, eat you a couple of marshmallows and it'll coat your throat and actually help soothe it. I didn't know if y'all knew that or not, but it's definitely handy to keep on hand <laughs> in case something like that. So I always like to have those too. Of course, back here, I got two more 24 packs of the bottled water. I got two more packs of, well, two more jugs of the spring water for my Keurig peppers there, gardenous. <laughs> and then I picked up two of the um, Fiesta Ranch dip mixes. You just add it to sour cream. So good, y'all. And I rewarded myself for having to go into the store today. These are my absolute favorite candy bars ever. I can typically only find king size, so I like the smaller ones, but these are really good. And then of course, y'all already know, I had to pick my husband up some of his cinnamon streusel coffee cakes as well. And then I think over here, we have our chips. So I've just got some plain old Ripple Originals, and then I got some fried dill pickle utzes, and then I picked up two bags of Doritos. They had those at a decent price, so I picked those up as well. So that's our chips this week. And then back over here, as far as like non-food stuff goes, I picked up some more of my collagen peptides. Um, I mean, it's not non-food, I do eat it, but um, mix it in my drinks and stuff and you can't even taste it. So I got some of that. Now non-food, <laughs> I picked up some conditioning shampoo, just the purple shampoo. That way it takes out that brassiness out of my hair. And then I also picked up some more of the um, toothpicks, the dental flossers. And then y'all, I saw this and I figured it would be perfect to keep in my purse. It's the Cinnamint, but it's a scope squeeze. It is actually concentrated. I don't know if I can get it to focus or not. You just add water. So you do like a couple squeezes in the top of this lid and then you fill the rest of it up with water and there you go. So figured that would be good to keep on hand. And then I picked up two of these golden apple tarts. They have been out forever and it's become one of my favorite scents. So I picked up two of those as well as y'all seen this in the store already, but I picked up some more um, mixing bowls, serving bowls, whatever you want to call it. So you get this large bowl and then you get a smaller one on the inside. So I picked up those and I also picked up, I almost forgot these, the 28 count of the snack packs. So you've got corn chips, originals, um, like the Cool Ranch Doritos, you got chili cheese, then you got like the off-brand Cheetos, barbecue, cheddar sour cream, and then of course like the off-brand Doritos. <clears throat> so I wanted to go ahead and pick those up too for lunches. But that is everything that we got this week. And the total is going to be down here as usual. All right, y'all. So that is it for this week's haul. I hope you enjoyed it and it gave you some ideas um, maybe you've seen some different things that I've purchased and I hope you like the way I've done the haul this time. And if I can keep doing these, I will, but y'all, I'm telling you, I love my Walmart grocery pickup. <laughs> I am not going to go on here and fib, but anywho, if you are in need of prayer, please let me know below. And until next time, my sweet friends, I wish you nothing but the best. God bless. Bye.